In a couple of days, I'll complete 15 years of using Evernote, and I had no plans to switch to another app, but some of you asked for a little help. <laughs> now I don't know what the future holds for me. So let's talk about that. First, I have to make something clear here. During this 15 years, I've been constantly testing other apps, but I don't think it's productive to keep switching to another app. So I would test them and come back to Evernote. And I think I always did that because Evernote has this simple to understand and use user interface. It's not the only app like that. Many times I'm teaching companies how to build uh, efficient and mindful workflows and Trello is a tool that I use all the time. I think what I'm trying to say is that this type of apps, the way they are designed, they are for people that are not tech savvy. For the last couple of days, I've been thinking about who among my clients would benefit from using Obsidian instead of Evernote, and I couldn't come up with anyone. I'm not saying that Obsidian is not a good app and that Evernote is the it's the best app out there. I'm just trying to say that for the type of people who are my clients, I think an app that is simple to understand and simple to use like Evernote is the best choice. If you're just looking for simple note-taking, Obsidian is very good. But the minute you start needing more advanced tasks, a calendar, and to some extent even tags, things can get geeky very fast. Maybe it's a question of asking ourselves if we can afford a little bit of friction in our daily routines. After all, life shouldn't be about being productive all the time. There's also fun. Isn't that right? Otherwise, why would I spend so many hours on that project? That's a an ancient computer. <laughs> that thing is from the 70s. I dedicated many hours to make that turn on. And it was fun. So maybe what happened here is that some of you guys that asked for my help, maybe you made me see that I'm the one who changed. In a way, all this situation has everything to do with what I'm trying to do more often here in the channel, which is share with you what I learned. I love to learn and share what I learned. Uh, many years ago, when I started my business, I didn't know what to do. And I tried this service that, to my surprise, did very well. People would pay me to learn software, especially new software, and teach them. <laughs> You'd be amazed of how many people don't have the time or don't want to go through all the learning process. I don't know why I stopped doing that, but one thing that I know is that what I love most on my consulting business is to learn how you do your work. Because I have to learn how the other person works to help with a software, with a workflow, and, and that's amazing. Uh, I've been learning so many incredible things along these years. So let me show you uh, just a couple of features on Obsidian that I think are interesting. Even if you're not planning to use it, Take a look at this, it's pretty interesting. If you are a Patreon or YouTube member, you already know that I use this Canva feature. It's great for organizing ideas. I also like the tabs. We can open multiple notes. This is information from a real client. All I did was shrink it like this. So yeah, you're not gonna see that. <laughs> the way Obsidian stores our files in the computer is also good for what I do here on the channel. And one thing I didn't like in the beginning was this daily note, today daily note. 
and now I'm having a lot of fun and there are many ideas that I would like to show you. To be honest, I don't know what's gonna happen to this channel, but it doesn't have to be all about this or that app. What if is more like, let me show you something interesting I just learned. And to some extent, it's already happening. There are other videos here on the channel about technologies that I use and love, like Mastodon, Trello, this watch, that computer. <laughs> anyway, please let me know what you think about all this. Thanks for watching, see you soon. If you don't have any idea what I'm talking about, you have to watch this other video. Bye. <laughs>